Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. This one will be fought in the pocket. Two guys will stand in front of each other. They will trade punches. They will trade kicks. It's going to be a classic matchup that you normally see inside of a ring. We get it in the octagon tonight. Slips. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the cover. So a combination of knees here. You don't see this all the time where a fighter will, will throw multiple knees, but if it's not broken, they'll fix it. There's no takedown threat. If there was a takedown threat, he would not be throwing so many knees. But there's no threat of getting taken down, so he is just letting those knees fly. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times... Whoa! Yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. Get over, get over, get over. All right, stacked guard here now. The feet are on the hips, DC, so for the top fighter, this is not at all ideal. No, this is not ideal, because now he has to try and stop his opponent from kicking him away. How do you do that? You attack the feet. You start grabbing the feet with the hands, lead with your hips, grab the feet with the hands, pass the feet to the side, and start to lead with your knee to try to get the side control. Straight right, he misses. So he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strokes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Ingonos has got full mount now. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get That is it! shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy. Here we go inside the octagon. For 